Hey guys, thanks for coming to my channel. Um, I am going to show you a video on how to use this tool called a TheraBand uh, in your stretching techniques. And if you are trying to improve your stretching and mobility, this is a really helpful tool. So as you can see, it's a, it's just a nice long band that is not attached, okay? And it's kind of flimsy by feel, but it's actually pretty strong when you start to use it in stretching. And um, I'm gonna show you a lot of different you know, movements and exercises that you can use. This is great for after yoga. This is great for after lifting. This is great for after any exercise or fitness that you do. Um, if you sit a lot, uh, I'm gonna show you some seated postures where you can use this band. So if you're not able to get to the gym or don't have time, just put it next to your office. After your Zoom call, go ahead and do a couple like five minute stretches with this, it's awesome. Uh, what I love about this is that it, it can, you can do a lot with this one little band. It weighs nothing. It's like a feather. You can fold it up and put it in your suitcase when you travel. Uh, and, and right now, I'm actually out of the country. I'm in Nicaragua on a surf yoga uh, retreat, and I'm out here enjoying uh, the nature and uh, this beautiful deck, and I packed this in my suitcase. So I'm gonna show you ways to use this band, and uh, it's gonna really help you feel good to stretch your upper body, shoulders, back, arms, all that stuff. Um, so just, if you have one of these, um, go ahead and grab it, and then let's get onto the mat. So find yourself in a seated position. This is called Japanese style. I like to do it on my knees, or you can do Indian style. I prefer this because it helps me with my hips. Sometimes my hips get really sore sitting in, in the crisscross. So if you sit on your knees like this, if you're able to, this is helpful. Uh, so this is only seated postures I'm showing you. Uh, so if you have any issues with your seated stuff, I can always show you how to elevate your hips. You can put a cushion underneath your knees. You can put a cushion underneath your bum here, okay? So we're just going to we use this band. This is called a TheraBand, right? So you're going to Bring your hands in the center like this. Have a little bit of slack on the edge. As you can see, there's a little bit of like little stuff here. So you can pull it tight to where your hands are shoulder width apart. You're right here, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a couple of just arm movements to go up above your head and all the way straight down, okay? But as you're doing this, you're gonna pull that band apart and keep it nice and tight. So you're right here, grab this part. Hands are going over, fingers going down shoulder width apart, nice and pull tight. You're gonna drop it down to the knees, sit nice and tall, shoulders are back and away, down away from the ears. And you're gonna look forward as you're lifting this hands up and keeping it right above the head. And you're gonna stack it right there next to the, next to the ears and the fist goes straight up to the ceiling. So they're not gonna go back or forward, right on top of the shoulders and come all the way down, keeping the core nice and tight. Make sure you're breathing through the nose, dropping that band down. And as you inhale, that's when you start to exhale and then do that movement as you breathe all the air out. Good, and now you're gonna come all the way back down. Nice and easy. This is not something that you do really fast. And you bring it right back up. So you'll feel this in your shoulders and in your upper back, which is really good. And if you are engaging your core, it's really nice there too. So you're doing a lot of different things and it's just an easy little stretch. Nice little movement to go up and down, helping your shoulders in your upper traps. Nice, okay, so that's a good one, right? Okay, so I'm gonna show you another one. So we're gonna go do some side bends here. So the same exact thing. Make sure there's a little, little slack here in the center. Pull it tight. Make sure it's a little bit wider. So see where my shoulders are here? You make it a little bit tighter. So it's nice and tight, right? So you're gonna start down on the lap here. Big inhale. And then on the exhale, move it all the way, all the way up. Stack it on the top of the shoulders. Keep this left hand straight up to the ceiling like you're punching the ceiling. And then I want you to start pulling that band down to the right and then look up to the left. If you can't see my left arm shaking, that's what it should be doing. Bring it right back up. And then again, you just repeat this probably like 10 times, nice and easy. Good, so always do the other side. Balance is key. This arm is locked up tight, then you're just gonna pull the opposite arm down, keeping the arm straight, elbows don't bend, right? Just like that. Good. Got a rest, 
Roll the shoulders out. Okay. Another move. This is my, one of my favorite ones. So, you're going to use both hands straight up to the ceiling. And now you're going to bring both hands across to the side as you drop the hips to the other side. And then you can look up, a little extra support there, and come right back. So that right hand goes down, the left hand follows, and the left hip goes opposite way. Feels really good in your obliques, really good in your low back. Keeping the abs tight. Nice, opposite way. We don't do enough side bends in our life. We have to do more of these. Very nice. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you my favorite one. This is like a, a very good rotation of the arms going all the way up, all the way back. And if you're not able to do this, this is gonna be a really great tool to help you do that, okay? Especially if you have a little, a little shoulder injury to help heal. It's like a really good PT type of movement, but also it's just really good to stretch the shoulders out. If you've been over a computer hunch like this, you wanna pull them out in a way, right? So it really helps you with the posture as well, with your spine. So I'm gonna turn around so you can see the muscles moving around. I'm gonna also show you the side angle so that you're gonna see different angles to understand where my arms and hands are and what my body is doing, okay? So I'm gonna show you the side angle first. Sitting in the same position on my knees, holding my band with my fingers over, knuckles are up, fingers are down, a little slack on the side. And I'm gonna pull it tight, drop it down on my knees, sit up nice and tall, Bring the shoulders up and then drop them nice and down, relax, and chin is neutral. And I'm gonna look straight ahead as I move my arms out, past my shoulder width, and keep it tight, pull my belly in, engage the core, big inhale first. And on the exhale, lift your hands up, arms are straight, and I'm going to pull the band top even more as I open up the shoulder blades, squeeze the shoulder blades here, and then Bring it right back. Good. Just drop it down again. Big inhale. Then on the exhale, bring it right back up. Squeeze the shoulder blades together. I try to touch that band all the way down as much as I can. Full, full rotation. And then bring it right back up in the same position. Arms are straight. Elbows are not bent. Bring it right back. Good. Let's do one more together. Big inhale. Exhale, lifting all up. The shoulders don't lift. So there's a difference. We don't lift the shoulders up, we keep the shoulders down and we're just lifting the arms. Really helps the uh, upper back muscles. Feels really good on those shoulders. Nice, so now I'm gonna turn around and show you the back part so you can see what my, what my uh, scapula is doing and my, um, and my shoulders, okay? So let me show you. See the position, same position here. Squeeze in the shoulder blades as you bring it back. Sit down nice and tall. Position the band the way that you had it. And look it up. Very nice. So this is the TheraBand. Okay, so this is super cheap. You can get like a box of them, okay? But or you can just get one of these from your gym. Um, TheraBand.com. I am not a sponsor. I just love this band, and so they're the only ones that I know that have them. So um, try it. It's so easy. It's easy to travel with. It's great for your shoulders. I mean, I'm sweating, <laughs> and it's not just the weather. It's literally the movement. But it's so nice. It feels so good, and um, it's uh, it's going to be helpful for your fitness journey and. For your mobility practice and for your even your inversions that I've been teaching you guys so it really helps with the shoulder to opening it up you know helps with the core helps with the back so uh, I want you to try it and then and let me know in the comments if you like it okay um, thanks for watching and hope you have a good day